still continue the conversation. Now, um, before we went on the break, I was asking of um, if personal security can affect a firm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So as I said, um, there are so many ways personal security can right. uh, affect a firm. That is, if measures are not put in place, um, the actions of an employee mm -hmm. can affect a firm. That is, the kind of information they give out there, mm -hmm. and the activities they perform on the internet can affect the firm in so many ways. All right. So should a firm take care of the security of its business? Yes, I think the firms have to do that, especially when it comes to um, the employees they work with. Right. Um, especially bringing devices to the office, your mm -hmm. personal devices to the office. Mm -hmm. They have to be um, a security control in place where um, the firm have to make sure they enforce the use of strong passwords. Mm -hmm. um, they avoid people or they avoid people bringing their devices to the mm -hmm. office um, or their workplaces mm -hmm. completely. Also, they should make sure employees do not um, download from um, sites mm. on, on their internet, especially these torrent sites. Mm -hmm. Some of them go online just to download movies, videos. And some of these videos or movies, um, malware can be attached to them. Mm -hmm. Immediately you download onto the system. Mm -hmm. the, some malware will not immediately identify itself or make slow down the system. It makes sure it propagates on the network, mm -hmm. affects a um, couple of devices before you start realizing that there are malware on the system. So I think when they enforce strong, the use of strong, strong passwords, mm -hmm. update um, devices in the environment, mm -hmm. um, also block certain sites so that employees will not visit them at all. How, how do we even tell if some of the sites we are visiting is not, is not the right ones? So when it comes to um, uh, these sites, mm -hmm. normally if you are visiting a, a site, right. when you look at the address bar, within the address bar, some of the, um, I think, the sites, you see an HTTPS. Yes, of course. The S stands for a secure website. Mm. Then we have the HTTP. Mm -hmm. Normally the address bar tells you that website is not secure. So you just have to be careful um, mm -hmm. the links that you visit. Mm -hmm. Some of them can be sent to you. And you might not even look at them. You might not even read. You will just click on them directly. Right. And then you'll be infected. Mm -hmm. Normally when a link is sent to you and you don't know where it's coming from, the best thing to do is click on it. Or you just mm -hmm. hover your mouse over the link just to see if the link is um, malicious mm -hmm. or... Genuine. All right. If you don't know or you can't tell whether it's genuine or malicious, don't just click it. Mm. And then so, so people who, who involve themselves in all this cyber act, do we penalize them when they are caught? And how, how, how do you people go about it? When you are caught or mm -hmm. when a case is brought in right. and then we investigate it, mm -hmm. um, it is normally taken to the courts. Wow. And then if you are found guilty, mm. that one, it has, it, the court has got to do its mm. work. I can't talk for the court. But then I know if you are caught in the act, mm. you will definitely be sentenced or be penalized for that. All right. So, so um, we have a whole lot of birthday messages coming in. Let me quickly do this. Now, happy birthday to the twins, patience and peace. Your birthdays are always double celebrations. May you two grow stronger, happier and braver. Wishing you all the best for your future. Coming in from Bernard Hansi. Happy birthday to Nishida Akufi of Akuse International School. Wish Wishing him long life with good health. May he grow in wisdom, strength, and the might of God. From Nene Akufi at Ekusi. Now this one is to, um, happy birthday to my dear wife and helpmate, Na Ache Akufi of Opportunity International Bank. So Manya, wish her long life with good health. May her dreams come to pass and her Hosts be enlarged. Nene Akufi at Akusi.
Happy birthday to Karen Ama Obin Jedu of St. Theresa's School. You are nine years old today. We wish you God's blessings upon you from your mom and dad and brother Kuju. Now, happy birthday to Mr. Lewis Ejei Amwakum of Ayarifa Teiman from Nana Yao. Have an awesome year, bro. Cheers to life. Now we have just about a few minutes to wrap up. Your last words. Okay, so I would uh, advise or put out there some best practices that mm. we can all take home. Right. And when it comes to personal security, mm -hmm. uh, when we go online or when we visit our social media pages, the kind of information we put out there, we should make sure we limit it. Mm. Everything that the public has to know. Mm. Some informations are very sensitive. Right. Also, we have to ensure that we use strong passwords on our devices and also make sure our devices are up to date. Mm -hmm. And also, um, use antiviruses or anti malwares to secure our devices. Mm. In case of theft or the loss of the device, you know your, your um, information is saved on that. Safe device right right so um thanks so much for coming we are very grateful that you, you passed through thank and i hope too. that the awareness you're creating continues thank you right. too so many thanks for watching this is where we draw curtains on this morning's edition of the breakfast live show if today is your birthday from all of us here at tv africa we wish you well enjoy all the good things life has to offer now going out to the production team a very big thank you for making us i mean this program awesome every day thanks so much for watching my name is lebene abrokwa till i come your way tomorrow have a blessed morning